like when you're a god man a car hit you like hancock and the car merges around your body and you walk away from that because you're a god you're a power you're a force you're an unstoppable force man true power you know we're risking our lives out there doing this work as it is written we are killed all the day long you know we're gonna receive power we're gonna receive for being faithful and being humble and accepting humility and humiliation we're gonna receive power man and every now and then we must meditate on that you know those of us that are truly sincere in this ministry man we're gonna shoot fire up man <laughs> We're gonna be like them comic books, man. We're gonna be straight out of a comic book, man. Real power, man. That's why those comic books resonate with Jake more than anyone else. Because it's in us, man. That power is really in us. It's like what the Lord can do. The Lord can basically lock that power, turn off that switch in you. But that power, we're, we're princes of the power in the spirit, man. Our spirits are charged. It's just the Lord toned us down, man. Locked off that sprit, but the Lord gonna turn that tap on, man. Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. Notwithstanding in this, rejoice not, that the spirits are subject unto you, but rather rejoice, because your names are written in heaven. We're not always gonna be on the bottom like we are right now. We're not always gonna be the butt of everyone's joke like we are right now. Oh no, that's the humiliation part. And if you prove that you can deal with the humiliation, then you have just proven you can deal with the responsibility of the power that is coming. Yeah.